there's a special taste from Mexico that has won everyone's heart in Portland, Oregon, and with a plant-based twist. I'm Eunice, your guide to vegan food and travel, and today I'm checking out La Casa de Mamá to learn about their bakery, their story, and of course, try some food. Let's go. Hi, I'm Alexa, and I'm one of the co-owners of La Casa de Mamá, a vegan Mexican panaderia based in Portland, Oregon. I co-own this business along with my family, my mom, my brother, my dad, and we're all working together to provide traditional homemade pan dulce in an accessible format and making sure that it's plant-based so that everybody can enjoy it. Every morning, the dough is freshly made and set aside to rise to form the perfect dough. Then they are topped with a sweet coating and color. But what exactly are conchas? A concha is a traditional Mexican pastry. Um, we grew up having it alongside our families, our aunts, our uncles. It was something we ate in the mornings along with our coffee or our champurrado. And what it is essentially is a warm, fluffy brioche with a sugar coating on top. And what's special about La Casa de Mamá's conchas is that we offer the sugary coating, so the topping, in a variety of different flavors. We offer anything from the traditional Mexican chocolate, strawberry, and vanilla, to flavors going a little bit more complex into macho, oreo, mazapan, rainbow, almond, and a fun seasonal one that we're doing this time around, which is pumpkin. But conchas aren't all they're known for. Miriam and her family also sell tamales and champurado. The tamales are prepared with the perfect salsa, cooked masa flour, and then it's placed on a banana leaf, topped with salsa, filled with veggies, then tightly wrapped up in the banana leaf and steamed until the perfect temperature. And to finish it all off, you must try their champurado. Champurado is a chocolate-based warm Mexican beverage slightly thickened with masa flour, and they prepare it with oat milk, chocolate, cinnamon, and vanilla. Okay, it is now time for the taste test. After watching them make it, I am so excited because my mouth is drooling. I just want to try all of it. So I have tamales, I have one of mole and cauliflower, and then one with black beans and asparagus, conchas, champurrado, like this is a feast that anyone's gonna wanna have. Okay, so let's give us a try. Oh my gosh. Mm. Literally every time I take a bite of these tamales, I'm just like, joy comes to my face because they are so good, they're so moist, they're not dry, they're perfectly stuffed. Like, that to me is the key to a good tamal. Like, you need to have really good flavor in the masa. The masa needs to be moist, and the moistness comes from the oil. Yeah, there's a lot of oil here for anti-oil. Who cares? This is not a time to be anti-oil. It's absolutely perfect. It's absolutely flavorful. Oh my gosh. Mm. Mm. And if you've ever had Salvadorian tamales, you'll know that these are very similar. They do have some Salvadorian love in there. I'm so happy right now. Especially when you're starving. Oh my gosh. Absolute joy. Okay, mandatory after every meal is dessert. So of course, after tamales, you mandatory have to have conchas. They put so much love into these and they're so fluffy. I didn't used to be a concha person, I'll be honest. I was always like, eh, it's all right. They were always kind of dry, but then when I tried theirs, I was like, I am a converted believer again. I'm addicted. They're just so soft and fluffy. And okay, enough talking. I'm gonna try it. Key pro tip, dip it in the champurrado to get that delicious taste of fluffy bread with hot chocolate. Ah. Mm. Heavenly. Again, so soft. Yes, this is a bread where if you bite into it, it looks just gonna come apart, but that's the best part. Oh, the icing on top, the sugary part is what just makes it. It's not a super sweet bread, which is really good. And then, oh my gosh, you have to enjoy this. <gasps> so champurrado is the perfect amount of thickness for a chocolate. I can, it's basically like an atoll. The chocolate flavor is, oh my gosh. This, everything here is just amazing. Like seriously, it like is comfort food for me and it takes me home every single time. If you're in Portland, make sure to look up their pop-up and try some of this food because you won't want to leave without trying it. Trust me. 